you drop off your mail at one of those blue collection boxes outside a post office, yeah. you expect it to get to the address on the envelope. Well, that's right, but tonight the Postal Service says those boxes at four local post offices have been compromised, and they want you to be aware of what might now be in the hands of thieves. Sam Luther explains where the vandals hit and what you should do if you mailed something at those locations. Sam. Well, Josh, Latricia, the postal inspector says these four locations all hit with the same kind of damage over the same time period. Now, a warning if mail you sent was inside. Gosh, I never heard of that before. Residents like Harry Scholl shocked to hear the news as customers walked up to read this sign explaining what happened over the weekend. Outside collection boxes damaged and vandalized anytime from Saturday afternoon until Monday. The postal inspector says the mail inside could have been stolen or compromised. Today, some are relieved. I was just really glad we didn't get here yesterday. <laughs> Normally, those recognizable blue boxes will be right here. Now in East Ridge, you can only see the spots where they used to be removed altogether due to damage. I didn't think people broke into mailboxes like that. But East Ridge wasn't the only post office affected. The postal inspector says Rossville, Dalton, and Rocky Face, Georgia, all experienced the same thing over the same time period. Some that live nearby calling for a change in post office protocol. It's not safe anymore for the outside boxes, I don't believe. Now, investigators say there's no real way for them to tell exactly what was taken, but they're asking customers to follow up and make sure that what they sent got to its destination. Sam, thank you. If you put mail in any of those collection boxes from Saturday afternoon to Monday morning, the post office wants you to give them a call. That toll-free number is on our website right now. That's newschannel9.com.